another social justice warrior that I believe I've exposed, right? Since that's the subject matter that we're on tonight, right? Huh. What is that guy's channel where, where all this started, the social justice warrior? I don't even know dude's name. I mean, I if I heard it, I'd be like, oh, yeah. I mean, but he's real into this subject matter or this genre, whatever, of justice and all that. But anyway, Edward Snowden. Huh. It was easy for me to expose him. You know? And people can still argue that it's not true, but uh, it's common sense, dude. The dude did not do all that to tell us. He did not risk all of what he risked to tell us that they're hacking our phones and spying on us. Jesus, man, really? Fuck out of here, dude. Huh. And then they trade a basketball player for a, a high-level fucking terrorist or whatever. They didn't ask for Snowden. They don't want him back. Fuck out of here. Huh. <laughs> you know? They don't care about Snowden. Because he ain't a threat. He's not even a factor. He's not a factor. They don't give a shit about him. They own him still. A female basketball player was more important to the government than Snowden. Obviously. Like, are you are you serious? Like, come on. Like, whatever, dude. You know? Um, uh, but you see? That's why... That's another reason why a lot of these social... Fucking justice warriors won't mention me because, look, in the end, they'll probably get exposed. Like, like they're afraid of me exposing them. Like, you know, Mr. Rhymes with uh, Narfugle or Nargoogle. Yeah, that guy. Huh. After that incident, oh boy, that dude is probably praying every night and thanking God that uh, that video hasn't come out. It will. Oh, it will. How many, as a matter of fact, how many of these fucking social justice warriors do you think are trying to actively fucking take me out? Him, because, huh, yeah. He's a hero. He wants you to think he's a hero. I'm this nice guy. I, I look like I used to get beat up my whole life. I, I I love you. I'm here to help. Yeah. No. I I I have my own opinions. I I'm mm hmm mm hmm. I I know better. I know well better. Anyway, um, <laughs> all these motherfuckers, dude. That's what they do. They're actors. They're actors. They're getting paid. At some point, when they're exposing shit. There, the certain people are gonna come, and knock on their door, just like Hassan Campbell had some dudes looking like FBI agents in his yard, when he was looking like he was gonna start speaking the truth on my situation. Yeah, he never did, did he? Who were those guys, right? Hassan Campbell seemed to have my back at first. Yeah, because he was talking about not on his watch. Basically, they're trying to kill me, and he he seen it. He he was seeing what was what, what was real, what was true, and it sounded like he was sticking up for me. He was talking about not on my watch, and then these fucking fed-looking motherfuckers show up in his yard. Things were never the same after that. You mean to tell me that shit ain't happened to the rest of these clowns, these so-called fucking truth speakers and patriots? Bullshit. That's why they won't speak the truth. <laughs> 